Esther 5.14 Then his wife Zeresh and all his friends said to him, Let a gallows be made fifty cubits high. Fifty cubits is seventy-five feet. So, And in the morning, suggest to the king that Mordecai be hanged on it. I suggest that Mordecai be hanged, Haman says, the king, says to the king. Zeresh and Haman's friends talked to Haman. Then his wife Zeresh and all his friends said to him, Let gallows be made fifty cubits high, and in the morning suggest to the king that Mordecai be hanged on it. There's, it also says impaled in one version, in a no, different version. Esther 5.14 Then go merrily with the king to the banquet. Happily go to the banquet. Haman's wife, Zeresh, and his friends say, And the thing pleased Haman. Or Haman. Good idea. So he had the gallows made. Okay, build the gallows. And go merrily with the king to the banquet. And the thing pleased Haman. And he had the... So he had the gallows made. Esther 6, 1. That night, in the evening, the king, the king couldn't sleep. I can't sleep. So one was commanded to bring the book of the records of the chronicles. Go get the book. And they were read before the king. The book of the records of the chronicles was read before the king to help him sleep. That night the, the king could not sleep. So one was commanded to bring the book of the records of the chronicles. And they were read before the king. Esther 6.2 And it was found written in the book of the record of the chronicles. It was written... That Mordecai had told of Bithana and Teresh, two of the king's eunuchs, the doorkeepers who had sought to lay hands on King Ahasuerus. Bithana and Teresh are going to kill the king, Mordecai had warned. Bithana, the king, and Teresh. And it was found written that Mordecai had told of Bithana and Teresh, two of the king's eunuchs, the doorkeepers who had sought to lay hands on King Ahasuerus. Esther 6 3. Then the king said, What honor or dignity has been bestowed on Mordecai for this? Was there, there some recognition given to Mordecai for what he did? Honor for Mordecai? The king asked his servants. And the king's servants who attended him said, Nothing has been done for him. The king tells the servants tell the king, Nothing was done for Mordecai. Then the king said, What honor or dignity has been bestowed on Mordecai for this? And the king's servants who attended him said, Nothing has been done for him. 